Good morning, camera. It's Friday. That makes it Film My Life Friday, the Friday in which I film my life. I'm sitting in my own room because I woke up earlier for some reason this morning. Didn't want to, just kinda did. Anyway, uh, there's a football game tonight. I will be going to said football game. Uh, we're playing Tabor, so we're probably gonna lose, but we've been losing a lot lately, so I guess that's no surprise. Uh, before the football game, I'm hanging out at Chloe's house, and we are playing Vampire Cops, which is the tabletop RPG that Chloe invented. Because we were bored one day, and we couldn't find any free ones, and Chloe was like, I'm gonna invent one! And we did, and it's great. Um, before that, I'm gonna go to school. And at school, I'm gonna do such things as hand money to teachers for stuff I should have handed them money for a while ago. And also... No, that's it. Hand teachers money. I'm a senior. Turns out being a senior involves a lot of expenses. Also just being in school in general. Says the guy who's probably gonna have to pay for college next year. Nope, don't need to think about my future now. Here we go. Morning. How are you? Oh, pretty good. How about you? Uh, Friday already. It is Friday already. We're nearly free. No, 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 no. Oh. oh, do you have to do the game tonight? Do I have to do the game tonight? <laughs> it was phrased like a question, but I think I already know the answer. I think you do. <laughs> Electronic music is over, and I'm here with yet another person at the Career Center I went to middle school with. Yes. I've not seen since. Do you know about this? I think this, uh, on Fridays I film my life. Oh, that's pretty cool. And creatively I call it Film My Life Friday. It's pretty great. See ya. Also, I'm taking my ukulele home for the first time in like two weeks, because for the first time in about a week, I have homework. And I know that most people aren't ecstatic about homework, but my homework is to write a song. What is my life? Beautiful? Beautiful. My life is beautiful, and I am grateful, and everything is great. And now I'm on the third floor, and I'm gonna keep walking. I'm gonna keep walking, and I'm gonna run into, oh hey, another friend from middle school that I now see again at the Career Center. Hi, Savannah. Hey. I'd say what a long is time no see you, but I see you in the hallway every day. Yeah. So, a long time no conversation. I still do the video thing. Oh. You remember that? Oh, girl, I'm just here today. I... Captain Bloom here. Yeah. How goes it? Good. How are you? Have a good weekend. You too. Everyone here is so friendly. Graphic design is over, and now I... And this one. Me too. And other people who ride our bus, and the other bus, are all headed back to our school to complete our day. You ready to do more wiring shit? Kill me. Yeah, that's pretty much all we've done in theater tech is cram wires into things. It's not great. It's not, no. It gets better. It, it does. It does. The class gets better. I've been told so repeatedly. Only by me, though. But here we are. Um, I'm on the bus now, and I have my ukulele, and Kayleen looked at it and went, wow, none of this audio is going to work. No, Kayleen went, can you sing Riptide by Vance Joy? Here we are. Friday? I'll find a way. 
It's so exciting for me, you don't even understand. What do I do now? Which way are you going? I'm going to the right. Okay, then you can keep going any longer. Good for you. I want to take a picture. Go for it. I'm going to the left. Oh, I'm so sad. This is really exciting for me, Eric. I don't think you understand. Bye. I got it on my Snapchat. Winning. Winning. Do you do this at Career Center too? Yeah. That's so cool. You really broaden your horizons. All right, I, I here try. I am. Okay. Goodbye. Bye. Oh, hi, Elena. I think I might have been wrong, because earlier I said that everyone at Career Center was so friendly. It might just be everyone everywhere. I think that is how it is. Maybe life is- camera and all of your friends constant need for attention. There is that. Bye. Bye. Welcome to Theater Tech, where we do such exciting things as put out chairs, and then later take up the chairs, and also put out cords, and tape the cords, and then later untape the cords, and take back up the cords. Where did the tape go? It's on the podium. Throwing with my left hand. Yeah, fail. Total fail. Sorry. <laughs> And now theater tech class is over. It was well, we didn't we didn't cram wires into holes, so it, it was an improvement, I would say. I think there was a wire. What and then what? What did you do? Uh, I put out chairs and then I taped down wires. Sounds like a sounds like a day. Sounds like a very standard day. Yeah. And probably next week I'm gonna get to help strike it. I say get to, be required to, for a grade is more more accurate. And now I'm home. Well, no, I'm walking there currently. There's no Christopher with me today because he went home on the bus with a classmate, uh, which is cool because I'm also hanging out with friends tonight and I'm sure we will reconvene later when I'm driving him home. Also, I think Meg is spending the night because her parents don't want her driving late, so I might have a sleepover tonight too, which will be cool because I like sleepovers. Well, Unless I have something the next day, but I don't have anything tomorrow, so I like sleepovers. Hooray. Basically, right now, I'm gonna walk home, put down my book bag, grab some money, grab some keys, drive to Chloe's. I might be tired by the end of today. I made it to Chloe's house. It turns out that whole segment I was filming earlier, camera was not on. <laughs> oh my god! So you didn't catch me with cereal on my... Iconic Sanjana. Okay, so here's cereal. So, okay, the 20 second diet is not here, but. I need you to clear this up for me. Like, what yes, am I on the bottom 20 second diet on the show? So. Wait, so should your character be your alignment? Because I made her not my alignment. I mean, Eric's character actually gets some, so it doesn't have to resemble you at all. Oh, Like his grade? Yeah. I think uh, I think Miss Mercer just kind of sighed and walked away. <laughs> Wait, this was for a school assignment. He gave this. Yes, he gave to Miss Mercer. Mercer. <laughs> that makes this ten times better for me. This is the first time I've ever watched this, and I'm like, I actually cried there in tears. How to describe the emotions coursing through my veins right now? This is possibly the Best slash worst piece of fanfiction I've ever read next to the milk fic. Don't even talk about the milk fic in this house of God. What's the milk fic? No! no. Author's note, special thanks, get it, cause I'm gothic, to my new GF, you know, not in that way, Raven. Bloody tears, these six six six, for helping me with the story and spelling. You rock! Justin, you're the love of my depressing life, you rock too. MCR rock. Hi. Eric, <laughs> put the camera on me. My name is Ebony Darkness Dementia Raven Way, and I have long ebony black hair. That's how I got my name. With purple streaks and red tips that reaches my mid back, and icy blue eyes like limpid tears. <laughs> and a lot of people tell me I look like Amy Lee. Authors know. If you don't know who she oh, is, okay. get the hell out of here! I'm not related to Gerard Way, but I wish I was, because he's a major fucking hottie. 
I'm a vampire, but my teeth are straight and white. I have pale white skin. I'm also a witch, and I go to a magic school called Hogwarts in England, where I'm in the seventh year. I'm 17. I'm a goth, in case you couldn't tell, and I wear mostly black. I love Hot Topic, and I buy all my clothes from there. For example, today I was wearing a black corset with matching black lace around it, and a black leather mini skirt, pink fishnets, and black combat boots. I was wearing black lipstick, white foundation, black eyeliner, and red eyeshadow. I was walking outside Hogwarts. It was snowing and raining, so there was no sun, which I was very happy about. A lot of preps stared at me. I put my middle finger up at them. <laughs> hey, Ebony! shouted a voice. I looked up. It was... Draco Malfoy! <laughs> What's up, Draco? I asked. Nothing, he said shyly. But then, I heard my friends call me, and I had to go away. Author's note. Is it good? Please tell me things! Chapter 2. Ebony! If you have any other color hair, you're a prep! We made it to the football game. We're late as hell. We're parked again under the flagpole because that's just the parking area now for us for some reason. And the line for tickets is crying. It's crying. We're playing Tabor, who's arguably our biggest adversary. Uh, used to be. We're about to be. Oh, yeah, we're about to. Are we already getting stomped? I don't know. I, I can't probably. see the score from here, but we're probably losing. <laughs> Because we're definitely losing. We're definitely losing. There's no way we're not losing. <laughs> well, yeah, At the beginning right. of the season, Ben was like, can't wait until we beat the living crap out of Reagan. And I was like, that's <laughs> not going to happen. And then I went to the first football game and I was yeah. like, Yeah. I don't know what it is, but we're bad this season. It's called a bunch of seniors graduated. Theater is dead at the end of this year. Oh my god, that's actually true. No, we have Elena and Lydia. Male theater is dead after this yeah, year. Yeah, there are no boys. There are no boys. There are yeah. no boys. None at all. Zero. Zero. Wow, I immediately <laughs> made the camera sweaty. We met 10 years ago and we planned to have a Hannah Montana sleepover and watch a Hannah Montana sleepover. And in 10 years, we've never done it. And we live two doors. This is about Hannah Montana. I have no idea what they're talking about. But to future Eric, editing Eric, you're gay, but I still love you. I just don't. Hey, sorry! to future editing Eric. Uh, to future editing Eric. Uh, I respect the gays, I just don't approve. <laughs> oh, that took a turn. I'm gay, it's a joke. Uh, I look like that took a turn. She's friends with me. I friends with you. You are a beautiful exception. Also, I see you about three times a year. Hi, child. I don't oh, know you. Megan. Megan? Hey. I know. Another Megan? These are my... Yes. I'm for several years going forward from this point, so... Oh, yeah. yeah. Uh, we lost, as I predicted this morning that we would. I predicted this three weeks ago. Yeah. We all knew we were going to lose. Uh, but that ringing you hear is, uh, Tabor got back the victory bell, uh, which is... A bell? A bell. That goes to whoever wins the Reagan Tabor game. Yeah. We had it last year and the year before that. And now they have it. Actually, the, the sophomore year Reagan Tabor game was really, really cool. It was great. It was really fun. There we had like nine awesome seconds left and we scored a touchdown and won. It was lit. It was pretty great. It was like something out of a movie. There's a post show. There's a post game show. There is? It's the chance for the guard to redeem themselves. Oh. Well, not really. It's the chance for everyone to redeem themselves. Okay. Now we're I love back. my friends! I love you too. Your presence is an eternal blessing in my life, and I'm saying that without irony. Oh, you waved to your neighbor. We're back from the football game now. I'm walking Chloe to her door before I myself... Wait, this is locked. Other door. And then... Oh, hey, you received a text. Good for you. It's from Ben. That makes no sense in the context of the vlog, but hi, Ben! <laughs> it's funny because two people and a thimble watch these. 
I'm the thimble. And now I am here at Sheets to perform my post-game ritual. Is this a ritual? I've decided it's a ritual of going here and getting a Fago because Fago is delicious and also high in sugar, which is good because I'm tired. Also, it just tastes really good. And now it is very dark, and you may or may not be able to see me, but oh well. Basically, me and Meg took separate cars, but Meg's sleeping over, so I'm waiting for Meg right now, and in the meantime, I'm gonna sit on my porch and enjoy this beautiful night and pet my dog. Oh my god, you're so cute. I, you live with me, and you're still... Oh my god, I'm just... Anyway, I'm gonna pet my dog, enjoy the night, uh, drink the Fago that I bought because yes, I've decided it is my post-game ritual and then Meg will show up and we will go to bed separately but you know, within the same house what are you, what threat have you detected? well, I should go see what my dog's up to so I'm gonna end the video here thank you, that is all I'll talk to you soon, goodbye